several years after a second marriage to fellow actor and colleague Saeed Balogo ended, Nigerians actress, producer and entrepreneur Fethia Balogo is ready to get married again. So at 52 years, Fethia Balogo is finally getting married again. At her birthday in 2020 on the 5th of February, she got engaged in Turkey to a mystery man. And this is coming after she has said several in interviews that she was done with marriage and she has tried twice and has failed therefore she thinks she's so unlucky when it comes to matters of the heart and after she has said that her previous marriage to Saeed was the toughest and their separation and divorce process was the toughest period and most challenging situation she has ever had to go through however she has said that the gift of her children from the union is one of the many blessings she will always be grateful for but now Faithia Balogo has not only found love she has found a happy place and is engaged to be married according to reports the man is just as lucky as herself and they are both held bent on keeping the union private and away from the public eyes on social media in interviews that she has granted after the engagement, she refused to mention him or answer any questions related to him. The mother of five grown kids, three from her first union and two with Saeed Balogun, who had to fight for years after her divorce from Saeed to go back to her maiden name Williams, has said that she is happy with her new man and has put to rest the number of pleas of her colleagues and friends and rumors that are asking her to get back together with Saeed. It has been said and it can be said also, we all know it now, that both parties have moved on and are only interested in the children they have together. In fact, the first time Saeed Balogun and Faithia will feature in a movie together after their separation and um, subsequent divorce was in 2019 july of 2019 that was the first time they would act together it's been said that they've not been cordial or that they've not had good relationship with themselves well fatal's unnamed man is not nigerian based he is a turkey based nigerian with businesses in instable turkey the families of both party have met and only set for the engagement ceremony that will be taking place in the course of the year. For people who might not know so much about Fethia Balogun, well, let's talk about some few facts and biography about her, including what caused her to change her name early on in her career, a career journey and movies that she has acted in. Let's do that, shall we? <laughs> so, her real name is Fethia Adunin Williams. She was born to a Christian family, not just a Christian, a Catholic family, and she is from Delta State. She, however, changed her name to Fethia when she got married to Saeed Balogo in 2000. So, she converted to Islam when she got married to Saeed Balogo. She was born on the 5th of February 1969 in Lagos State, but originally she hails from Delta State. She graced her screen on the super story Face of the Seeds, where she played an old woman. And she has said that that was the first time she would play the role of an old woman. And she's been looking forward to play the role of an old woman because it's like she's been stereocasted in the industry. And luckily for her, in one of the movies that she produced recently, she actually played the role of an old woman and she killed the role. If Etia Balogun is not at work, she is sleeping or on vacation, you could also find her in her stores where she sells body beauty products and her hair salon and hair store where she sells wigs and luxury hairs for people to buy. She is a brand ambassador for several bands and an influencer for several other as well however like 
Most people in the industry, there's always controversy surrounding them. One of such is different allegations of us seeing other men. But of course, with our recent engagement, that can be put to rest as we all know she is definitely with one man, a mystery man that when they decide to reveal his face, of course, we would hear from her who the man is. But one of the most recent controversies that she had been involved in is the issue with Remy Surutu, where they actually had a physical altercation in the ceremony of one of their industry colleagues. So there was a burial ceremony. A colleague was, you know, celebrating the life of her father. And there and then, Remy Surutu decided to confront Faithia Balogun about some issues both of them have. Remy Surutu went her head to hit Fetia Balogun, according to reports. And when Remy Surutu was interviewed and asked why she would decide to publicly insult a colleague, she was like, Fetia is a junior colleague to her by matter of age and also by years in the industry. And therefore, Fetia has no reason to insult her or talk behind her and so when reports got back to her Remy Surutu that Fethiya Balogo has been speaking ill of her to people and Fethiya not considering the fact that Remy Surutu has been very kind to her. Remy Surutu said when she and Fethiya when Fethiya and Sahid Balogo first got together and they were struggling as a couple in their finances they stayed at her place for several years and even when they broke up she was one of the senior colleagues that were trying to get them back together and therefore she does not deserve to be ridiculed by Faithia Balogo and her decision to hit her in public was very intentional and she does not regret it which is why Faithia could not even return the slap when Remo Surutu hit her in public and that is just one of the several controversies Faithia Balogo has been involved with in her career. But nowadays, she's just been a gentle 52-year-old woman minding her business and, you know, making her cool cash. In June of 2016, she was confirmed, conferred a chief tenancy title at Abute Meta as the Atesheshi Adini, and it was graced by several colleagues of hers. The decision to confer with the chief tenancy title by the Muslim community of Abute Meta was as a result of her contribution to the Islam community in that place. They decided to make her the attache she had in it. So of course you can refer to Faithia Balogo as a chief. The powerhouse performing heart is our way of giving back to Nigerians and grooming people interested in the media life. She has a school of performing art and that is our way of giving back to people. She also has a foundation where she, you know, gives back to the people that are needy in this society as a way of giving back to the society we of course love us some entrepreneur anyways that will be all about Fethia Balogo and her engagement if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up do not forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell beside the subscription button I really do hope you enjoyed this video and you'll be back for more and of course when Faithia's mystery man is revealed. I will bring you the full gist. Until then, take care of yourself and bye.